go out. We need to promo. We need to take advantage of the hype we are creating in other countries. We need to be more visible in other markets. But it seems to be slow to happen. Now we've seen some action there. What is going to, what is going to take it for others to jump on that wave? Well, it will take investment and I mean, a lot of money. Is it largely the money? It. Yeah, it's a lot of money. I mean, and obviously it will take a certain level of partnership and involvement from the likes of Miziki uh, Media and some of the major labels. Mm. Um, I mean, I, everybody's commending Sarkozy here for um, touring Africa. But it's tied to the deal that he signed with Miziki uh, Media, for instance. Uh -huh. You know, they had, they had, there's a, so there are different models when it comes to the music business today. I mean, there's a proverbial 360 deal, and then these days we're doing the advanced um, deal on projects, on albums, on singles. Um, from what we understand, um, Ziki Media is actually bankrolling this. And so as an organization, as an entertainment company, they are having to put in an extra budget down for marketing and promotions right. to ensure that they are able to activate the music and the talent in the various most important markets for them in Africa so they can ensure that the streams or the necessary mm -hmm. ways, the revenue lines that they sign to are able to generate the, or get their money back. I mean, it's a lot of money. So it definitely requires a lot of money to activate one's music and brand in different markets. There are ways to do it. I mean, it's either you can do it through uh, promotional channels, TV, radio, online, um, and all of those things. You can do it with events, um, little events, meet and greet, and all of that. All of these things are geared at activating the brand, activating the music, and getting the gatekeepers in the various different markets to amplify it so that you can get people to actually stream today. Mm -hmm.